Hello everybody, this is Gary. Today is Friday, April 24th, 2020. It is now 5.49 p.m. Eastern Standard Time in the United States in Rochester, New York. This is just an update on my coping with my mental illness and the coronavirus. Um, today my anxiety is pretty bad. Um, my paranoia is pretty bad. My depression is pretty bad. My insomnia is pretty bad. Um, I know there are a lot of people in situations a lot worse than mine. Um, I'm just frustrated more than anything else. I ordered a lot of things online and it's taking weeks instead of days to have them delivered. Um, I'm waiting for a new air mattress because I sleep on air mattresses instead of a regular mattress. The mattress I have might pop and if it does then I'm going to be sleeping on the floor because UPS didn't deliver my other new air mattress. I like to keep two on hand at all times, but I didn't realize it would take this long for the delivery to be made. I keep checking the UPS website and all they tell me is that my package has been delayed and they don't know where it is. Um, last time I uh, got an update on where it was, it was in East Syracuse, New York. I'm not even sure where East Syracuse is. I know where Syracuse is. I didn't know there was an East Syracuse, New York. Um, but anyways, I'm coping as best as I can. A little bit jittery today, a little bit nervous. Um, I got food in the house. Um, I did go to the emergency room the other day for um, what I thought was breathing difficulties. It turned out that my esophagus was just having spasms. It made me feel like I was having difficulty in breathing. But they did a, a chest scan, x-ray. That came back normal. There's nothing in my lungs. My lungs are clear. They did an EKG, and from what they could tell from the two EKGs they did, there's no damage to my heart. Um, I am a heavy smoker, and that's why I thought that I might be having breathing problems. But at least for now, I'm not having any breathing problems, and the spasms in my chest are continuing. But that's just from my esophagus, because I have gastroesophageal reflux disorder, also known just as acid reflux. And it's irritating my esophagus, and esophagus and causing me to have spasms in my esophagus in my chest. It feels like I have to take a deep in breath and then let it out. And then I start breathing normally again. Um, I thought that was difficulty in breathing, but apparently it wasn't. Um, I was eating this morning and I have difficulty swallowing. I got some, partly from GERD, the acid reflux. I was swallowing food. I wasn't choking because the food didn't get stuck up here. It got stuck here down in my chest. And it felt like I was choking. I called an ambulance. By the time the ambulance got here, the food had gone all the way down. And so I didn't need to go to the hospital. But I really felt like I was choking. That's why I called the ambulance. Because um, it may have been necessary if the food didn't move on its own. If it moved up, then I would have been choking on it. And so that's kind of frightening. I'm kind of scared to eat or drink anything now um, for fear of choking. But uh, I guess that's all for now. Um, I've had better days than today and yesterday and the day before, just trying to hang in there and survive like everybody else. And, um, if I'm shaking because that's because I'm shaking my leg cause I'm nervous. Um, so kind of agitated, um, not feeling real good. Um, doing the best I can like comment, share, subscribe, press the notification bell.